Hello, and welcome to How Tech Tutorials. In this video, we will teach you how to use the SUMIF function in Excel. SUMIF allows you to sum a range of values using a single criteria or a condition. To add multiple conditions, you can use the SUMIFS function. So over here, we have a sales forecast sheet. Let's say we want to calculate total sales in the West region. For that, we will use the SUMIF function. Let's start by clicking on the Insert Function button here. Search for the SUMIF function and select it from the results. First, let's select the range for our criteria. Over here, we will select the cells in the region. For the criteria, we will type in West in inverted commas. Now let's select the range of cells for product A, which will be summed based on the criteria. Once we hit Enter, you can see here that the formula has added all the sales figures for the West region only. Now let's add a date range to this calculation. Let's say we want to calculate total sales in the West region between 15th January and 15th February. Let's click on the Insert button function, search for the SUMIFS function, and select it from the results. This allows us to add multiple criteria in a single formula. For starters, we will select the sum range, which would be all the sales figures for product A. Next, we will select the criteria range, which would be all the cells next to region. For criteria, we will add west and inverted commas like we did before. Now we will select the range for the second criteria, which would be all the cells containing the date. We want the criteria to pick values from the lowest date. For that, we will add greater than and equals to in quotes. Next, let's insert ampersand and reference the cell with the lowest date. Next, we will add a similar criteria, and the only difference would be that we will be adding less than and equals to in the criteria and reference the highest date. Hitting Enter will calculate total sales in the West region between 15th of January and 15th of February. That's all. Is there any Excel function you would like to know more about? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching. If you liked this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. And make sure to press the bell button to be the first to know about our new videos.